Also new tonight, a panel of lawmakers in Annapolis just voted to rescind the mask mandate in public schools. It's an issue some parents have been debating for weeks. WJC is live. Avador Burnett has been following this story from the beginning. She's here now to explain what this means for your children when they go to school. Have a joy. <laughs> Hi, Vic. Well, this new decision now means tens of thousands of students here in Maryland will be able to go back to school without wearing a mask, a face covering. But exactly when they'll be able to do that will depend on where they live. The Geyser household has something to celebrate tonight. Uh, it was really exciting. And after weeks uh, of fighting to eliminate mask mandates uh, in schools, they now have a win. It's about time. Um, they should never have taken that control away from the parents in the first place. A bipartisan panel of lawmakers in Annapolis overwhelmingly supported a move to rescind the mask mandate in schools effective next Tuesday. It's refreshing to see things moving in the right direction in Maryland. After months of protests, the final decision on masks will now be up to the local school boards, and the ball is already rolling in many of those districts. Anne Arundel County got rid of the mandate several days ago. Howard County announced they will drop the mask mandate next Tuesday because of high vaccination rates. Baltimore County said if transmission rates continue to go down, they could eliminate masks sometime in March. Carroll County said the mandate will disappear after the state lawmakers vote. Harford County set up a meeting for Monday. But Baltimore City officials said they have planned no adjustments for masks in schools, but they will continue to get advice from the health department. Masks work. They are a simple tool. Some parents and the state teachers union fought unsuccessfully to keep the masks on in schools a little while longer. Health and safety must remain a priority. We are not out of this pandemic yet. The Geyser family said they decided to homeschool their children because of this mask mandate. But now that it is out the door, those kids will go back to in-person learning in the fall. Live in North Baltimore, Avajoy Burnett for WJZ.